Good morning guys, it is day nine and we are headed out pretty early. It's about eight in the morning and Nicole, Cheyenne, Sam and I are headed out to the wake making class. Um, with the Progenial, you can take different workshops for your concentration and when we were looking up workshops, there was a wig making one, which is really exciting. It's with two of the best wig makers in the world, which is crazy. And early, our class starts at 9 a.m. and it's a nine hour class. We're gonna be there until 6 p.m. tonight. Um, I'm gonna see if I can film any of it at all, but I don't know if I will be able to. So I might see you later, but today might be a pretty short vlog. Um, so we'll just kind of play it by ear. I'll see if I can get some shots in of the wigs and of um, what we're doing today. So let's see what today brings us.
So we just finished, I answered me, we just finished um, most of our day. Our wig making workshop was unbelievable. Um, I was able to film some of it because it was really cool, um, which I'm really happy about. Friends are um, awesome. Oh God. Um, and then we got out an hour early, so we went and finished the Kafka house, and those exhibits were crazy. Um, I'm really glad that we did get to go see those. Um, I'm looking at all the street food right now. It's making me so hungry, but we're making a homemade dinner tonight, so that's exciting. And then we're going to go out for Curtis's birthday tonight, so I don't know how much more I'm going to film. Maybe I'll film us making dinner, but then I'm probably going to say goodnight. We have to go this way. Um... So yeah, we'll see what else I film today, but otherwise I will see you tomorrow. We are going to Kutnohora, um, and we're going to see a church made out of bones, which is really cool. So that is really all I have to say today. Um, maybe I'll see you later, maybe I won't, so we'll see what happens. Good morning. <laughs> so today we are going to Kutnohora, um, it is day 10. Really? Wow. Um, we have taken two trams and now we are on the train and we're going to go see a church made out of bones. This train is actually like Hogwarts, um, which is the metro, not the tram. I don't think um, it matters. It doesn't like, matter. that part out, please. Um, this train actually does look like Hogwarts. We're in this like little car thing. We have this really cool door and then we like just have a bench and some things and the window open. So that's really cool. Um, yeah, we're going to see a church made out of bones. I'm really excited about this. Um, also, I didn't have to play my train ticket, which also made me really excited. So that's awesome. Um, I'm going to go to sleep now because I am tired. Um, but I will sleep.
definitely an interesting day, but we saw some pretty cool stuff. <laughs> But we saw some pretty cool stuff. Um, and now Cheyenne, Sam, Nicole, and I are packing. Um, Sam's room and my room currently look like this. Um, and, and this is pretty much the trend throughout the whole apartment right now. Um, because tomorrow, the four of us leave for Italy. Um, and we're, our taxi's picking us up around 12 noon. So we don't really have a lot of time in the morning to get stuff done. Um, so we're trying to get as much done tonight and then just have like our toiletries and our clothes out for the morning so that we can finish packing and then just relax and take a one last look and clean the apartment with Eden um, so that she's not left to do it by herself before we leave for Italy. Um, I'm gonna take you guys out with me tonight. We're going to dinner. I'm not really sure where we're going. Um, but I haven't really taken you guys out at night, um, mostly because I take a smaller bag with me, and I'm scared. You, I'm scared you guys are gonna get lost. Um, so that's why I haven't been bringing you guys out at night, and I've just been showing you like the daytime stuff. But we'll see what happens in Italy. Maybe I'll bring you around a little bit more. Um, but that is what's going on right now. Um, my foot situation, I haven't really talked about. I don't really know what's going on, but I currently have it wrapped with um, some sort of sauce that can be frozen. They didn't really have ice packs or frozen peas, which I personally prefer when icing a body part, but that's okay, this works. So I have made a compression and um, icing combo situation for myself right here. Um, I'm not really sure what's going on. I think it might be a stress fracture, but I'm probably not going to find out until I go home. Um, mostly because I don't want to chance the hospitals here, and I know I can take care of it myself as long as I rest it as much as I can, and I'm not really going out in heels and being super crazy, um, which I haven't been doing. I've been very good. So that is that. Um, we are heading out in the next few minutes, so let's see where we go for dinner and what happens.